Hey everybody, it's Robert Mickelson with the Mickelson Group, Remax of Santa Clarita. I hope you're doing well. In this video today, we're going to talk about how you buy a home when you have another home to sell. More about that in this video coming up next. Okay everyone, it's Robert Mickelson, Mickelson Group, Remax. In this video, we're going to talk about how you go about buying a home when you have a home to sell. You need that equity out of that house because you need to buy the new home with that larger down payment, but the money's coming from your house. So how do we get that done? There's basically two ways to make that happen. The two ways to make that happen, to buy a house when we're selling one, is you're either going to sell your house non-contingent, meaning when you secure the buyer for your home that you're selling, you're going to sell it non-contingent, meaning you don't have a home to buy. You might possibly move somewhere temporarily at the end of the close of escrow when you're selling your home that you're relinquishing. The other way to go about selling your home when buying a new one is selling it contingent on you finding your home of choice and a concurrent close. And what that means for you is you won't be forced to move out of your home unless you find your home of choice and you're gonna secure a concurrent close, meaning you're not gonna make an in-between move. You're going to sell your house and move directly into the new one within a day or so. That's all negotiable. That being said, that is the safest way to go about buying a new home when having to sell one if you absolutely can't make an in-between move like some people have to do when they sell non-contingent, when they have to move into a family's home, move into a hotel, move into a temporary rental. Those are sometimes looked down upon and super inconvenient. So selling your home, needing a home of choice contingency and a concurrent close contingency is the way to go when you're ready to sell a home and buy one at the same time. Now, when you go to make an offer on that new purchase, more than likely it's gonna be a contingent offer because you're selling a home. And if it's not, that's because perhaps you sold your home non-contingent and you moved somewhere temporary and now you're making a non-contingent offer in that case. But more than likely, you're gonna be making a contingent offer on your home that's selling in order for you to buy this new one. Now that does create some hurdles in a super competitive seller's market in that the inventory is low, there's a lot of buyers, so there is buyer competition. Our job here at the Mickelson Group is to position you excellently so your offer stands out from the crowd we wrap it up with a pretty bow and we use our influence and connections in the community to get your offer accepted. That's what we do best here. So if you are selling a home and you wanna buy a new one, you need to get that equity out, get top dollar and get an awesome deal on your purchase. We are your go-to team here in the Santa Cruz Valley to make that happen. We're here to help you anytime you can call us at that number behind me, 661-373-2374. Find us over at our website micklesongroup.com where we have all of our blog posts, all of our videos that you're seeing now, and of course, every listing for sale that you could possibly choose from. We we'll look forward to hearing from you. Until then, take care.